Hi there, I'm James Leeming. I'm the head of delivery for HS2. Uh, we're here in Green Parkway at our Skanska Coste and Strabag JV delivered uh, main shaft. Um, purpose of this shaft um, is to allow us to extract the tunnel boring machines um, from the tunneling once they've completed. And this shaft in particular is quite special because it, it's actually been designed for us to extract not one but two tunnel boring machines in sequence. Uh, what you'll see behind is a very large steel can, a shutter pipe we call it, which um, will be extended uh, to form a cylinder. The tunnel boring machine will drive into the cylinder and then we'll be able to then extract that um, via cranes um, out onto into the atmosphere. Um, and then we'll repeat that process again with the, uh, with the next tunnel boring machine currently making its way from Victoria Road box um, towards us as we speak. So. Um, also be able to see here the, the waterproofing is still um, being completed and then we'll complete the, uh, the rest of the RC works and that will be the shaft, um, shaft complete. So one of the main challenges we've faced at Green Parkway has been the groundwater. Um, water table here is quite high uh, and during the construction phase we've had to do a lot of dewatering, uh, a lot of grouting, um, some various other techniques in order to stay on top of the water situation here and make sure we can safely construct these shafts. Um, now that we've constructed the shafts, as you can see, um, the, the water situation is well under control, but we're still pumping out a significant amount of water um, and that is then tested and then recharged into a local aquifer uh, and back into the, into the water table. Um, as you can see behind us, the, the waterproofing membranes are all in place, so once the secondary lining's in, the, the shell of the, um, of the structure will be complete. 